Okay. So maybe you're in a position where you're not entirely sure you're going to get the outcome that you really wanted. But when you, you do get it, you know that it's going to make an absolute difference to your organization and the way that you're working. And that's really what we're going to talk about today. We're going to talk about how to get a good outcome for things. And it all really starts with the reason why and how you explain this to everybody in your team. I mean, have you ever heard the story by which uh, when you're trying to build a house, you go speak to the builders and ask them what they're actually doing, and the bricklayers will say, I'm filling bricks. Or the roofer might say, he's putting a roof on. But wouldn't it be better if actually they all turn around and say, we're actually building a really good house, or building a house of your dreams? And this, this actually happens in real life. I mean, there's a very famous story about when JFK went to NASA and he was asking everybody about what they were doing as their roles, etc. And he actually spoke to one of the janitors and the janitor turned around and said, I'm sending a man to the moon. So even at the point where the person who was cleaning the floors, making sure everything's perfect for the people who are working in that environment, he knew what the outcome was for that organisation. He knew exactly where it was going. And really, embodying that within everybody in your team can really help make sure that you move things into the right direction. Because you want people to be thinking about how they can make that outcome work for you. How they can get to that position where it's actually in place, rather than worrying about the process of going through it. So it could be that you need a bricklayer to lay bricks. It could be that you need to go through and you need to iterate through some sort of program cycle or design cycle. But really, those are just the tools of how you get from where you are now to where you really want to be. What you really want, though, is the outcome. And you want everybody on your team to be focusing on what that outcome is. So I challenge you to go away and really make sure that your team is focused, that you know that you're going to get the outcomes. Otherwise, you're just going to be in a position where you're not going to get really the results that you're looking for. I'm Martin Sharp and I hope this works very well for you. Bye for now.